you want to trap slugs in your garden, but with this current crisis, you don't know where to start? You came to the right place, because in this video, I will show you how to make a DIY slug trap that will help you protect your garden, and the best part is that I'm sure you already have all the materials at home. So without further ado, let's start trapping those slugs. Our growing season is coming, and with it, slugs. Usually, I would make a beer trap that I made last year, but this year, there's something different in the air. When trying to make my slug trap, I found out that I don't have any beer left. So I need to think something different this year. Because with this current situation, and with all the social distancing, I will advise you to avoid visiting stores and buying stuff that is not necessary. But then I remembered that I have something in the shed that I can use. And I'm sure you all have it at home. I always have it here. I think it's almost three years old now, but fortunately it's still within its shelf life. And I'm talking about toilet paper. With this current situation, I saw that many of you are stocking on toilet paper. And because I know you won't use that much, because let's face it, who uses 50 rolls of toilet paper in four weeks, right? I know you can use some of it in the garden. And the beauty of this slug trap is that after you trapped all the slugs in your garden, you can throw it into your compost pile and compost it. So how this trap works? It's kind of simple. The toilet paper is just doing what it's supposed to do. Trapping brown, sausage shaped things like slugs or poo. You get what I'm talking about, right? To set this slug trap, you roll your toilet paper all around your garden beds. If you want the best performance with this slug trap, you will need to use 4-ply toilet paper. You can get away with 3-ply, but you need to place it into rows. Otherwise, the slug will escape from it. To maximize the coverage of my trap, I will also place it in my pathways. That way, the slug will not be able to crawl to my raised beds. Are you still wondering how this trap works? It's simple. The 4-ply toilet paper absorbs a lot of water. And slugs? Well, water is one important thing slugs use to crawl. You see, the slugs produce slime, on which they slide around. But when there is a toilet paper in their way, that will absorb all the water and dry the slime out, the slug wouldn't be able to slide anymore, and would be stuck in place. Like a boat, on dry land. Genius, right? But there is one main disadvantage with this method. You see, when toilet paper absorbs any kind of moisture, it becomes useless as a slug trap, because it can absorb any more moisture. So every time that it rains, or there is a morning dew, the toilet paper will absorb the moisture and become useless. But luckily, the toilet paper is cheap and it's compostable, so you can use it at your heart desire. So for those of you who stuck to the end, I have a bonus video on how to make a DIY slug trap and to see a test if beer performs better than slug pellets. You can click on the video that pop on the screen to learn more about beer as a slug trap bait. If you enjoyed in this April's full special, don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to my channel to learn more about gardening and make a step towards your small garden journey. Happy gardening!